Hi and welcome to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can automatically forward emails from one mailbox to the other. Let's head start by heading here to the wheel and clicking on settings. You'll want to uh, click on the tab forwarding and pop IMAP. And then here in the forwarding section, we want to add a forwarding email address. So here for this video, the example that I'm going to use is that I'm going to be on vacation for the next four weeks, and I would like all of my emails to be forwarded automatically to my manager. So I'm going to start by tapping in the email address of my manager. And hitting next. Once I do that, I'm going to have to confirm a couple of times. And here we are in the forwarding section at the moment is disabled. But if I do want to enable it, I just need to click here on this uh, box. And then as you see here, the uh, email address of my boss appears here. Now I can choose what will happen to the emails in coming into this current mailbox. I can either keep it like this, I can mark it as read, I can archive it or delete it. So it's up to me to choose what is it that I want to do with the emails incoming. Now, I would like to add another email address, so to do that, I just need to add here, add a forwarding address, and this time, I would like to add my own personal email address, because I am going on vacation for a very long time, so I do want to uh, keep up with the emails incoming, so I'm going to insert here my personal email address, I'm going to hit send and confirm. Now, before I can go ahead, I need to verify this email address. A verification code has been sent to the forecast email address, so I'm just going to go get that code and I'll be right back. Here I am with the code. I'm just going to click on verify. And now here under the email section, you will see that my email, my personal email has been added. As a side note, you can always just remove an email very easily just at the bottom here of the drop down. You can remove either the email of my manager or my personal email myself. Now, as you can see in this section, you can always only set up one forwarding email uh, email address. What if I want to um, set up two forwarding uh, rules at the same time? So I want my emails to be sent not only to my manager, but to myself at the same time. For that, I need to create a filter. So let's just go ahead and do that. But before we do that, don't forget to click on the save changes at the bottom of your screen. Now, let's go ahead and create a filter. For that, let's come back here to the settings. If I go onto the forwarding and pop IMAP uh, tab, I see here that I can create a filter. So I'm just going to click here on this link. And in the sections, including the words, I need to type exactly delivered to and the email address of my current mailbox. What does this mean? It means that for all the emails that are delivered to this current email address, I want to create a filter for it. So instead of clicking on search, I just click on create a filter over here. Now here in the filter section, you have to check this box here so that all the emails are forwarded to a specific address that we're going to select now. So as I click on the drop down, I'm going to select my personal um, email and click, click on create a filter. And there we go. Now, if I go into my tabs called my tab called filters and blocked addresses, you'll see that all the emails delivered to Karen uh, Castelli at dev.forecast.io will be forwarded to my personal mailbox that is uh, listed here. Now, at any time, I can choose to either edit this filter or delete the filter um, very easily here in the filter section. I hope this video was useful. If you do have any questions, let us know.